Hello my dear students welcome back to class so today we are here with the continuation of our chapter chapter number 14 our environment in this chapter we have already discussed about the environment now today we are going to know something more about our environment so today we are seeing that there are two terms one is globalization another one is global warming okay globalization and global warming these two words are totally different from each other globalization means see the definition globalization is the process of interaction and integration among the people from different countries okay when people from different countries meet each other and share something related to their business culture and many more like they are sharing their goods service technology information okay and culture so when they are sharing things and services with each other so that time it will be called as globalization that means we are exploring to the world is that clear now next term is global warming now what is global warming global warming is increase in temperature in our environment okay global warming is gradual increase in temperature in our environment so why does this global warming happens okay so we will understand this when the amount of carbon dioxide okay when the amount of carbon dioxide is increased in atmosphere okay so because carbon dioxide is a hot gas so definitely it will raise the temperature of our atmosphere and when the temperature of our atmosphere is high it starts the melting of ice in the polar regions because of increase of carbon dioxide when co2 is increased it is affecting in the melting of ice in the polar region and if this ice are melt okay if total ice of polar region will be melt then there will be no land raising from the water all the land part of the earth will go under the water because polar region has that much of ice cover that if it is melt then whole world will go under the water so that is another trade so global uh, sorry global warming is affecting much more to the, our environment okay in terms of melting of polar ice change in climate changing climate means when its uh, co2 is increased in the atmosphere so definitely it will uh, increase the temperature of that reason okay of the atmosphere so definitely it is changing the climate next is risk of extinction of the species okay risk of extinction of species that means the species which are in danger okay which are in very less number which are left in very less number in our on our earth so they are they will be extincted if global warming will be there because many special or endangered species are living in the polar region and if this polar region will melt then definitely they will not have any habitat to live in okay so that is how this global warming is affecting our environment so hope you understood well meet you in next class thank you very much